Hi there! When you're done with this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and also hit the bell for notifications so you can always see the video first. But most importantly, enjoy the show. Hello audience, it is I, Zeke Fowler of Zeke Rambles and Cosmic Rejects, and today we are going to have ourselves a Zeke Ramble about Ultraman Arc, episode 14. Uh, I'm not going to say that Ultraman Arc is back on its good foot just yet, but it's um, picking itself up nicely. Um, we get to learn why Ultraman Arc is, and how that relates to the past six episodes. And lightly the um, first six episodes, though really the first six episodes I, at this point exist just to explain what type of flavoring you're going to get with the season of Ultraman. Um, but anyway, the like the ongoing arc about like people fucking up their own planets or trying to find ways to stop their planets from being fucked up is what the plot is about going forward and Ultraman Arc is about to have that happen to his planet but ex exactly why and how that ties in I'll have you watch the show to find out because as I as I say in all of and well the majority of my reviews um, I, I don't do spoilers and I don't do play by plays because quit being lazy and watch the fucking show get your own opinion all right you want to know like if I'm, I'm here to entice you but anyway, um, I will say the episode is like well written. Some excellent practical effect shots. One really good eerie uh, mix shot. That's like a combination of like stop motion and CGI. That's a really good shot. And um, we finally get introduced to uh, the main villain. So, or or at least a lackey for the main villain. But you know now we're like we're kind of on. We're getting the ball rolling for the final um, stretch of Ultraman arc. And um, I'd say for the beginning of this story arc, things have been set up very nicely. Um, if you wanted to jump back into Ultraman arc, this would be a good time to do it. Thank you all for watching to the end of this video. If you enjoyed Zeke Rambles, then you might also enjoy Cosmic Rejects. That's right, Cosmic as in stars in space, underscore Rejects. Cosmic Rejects is my Let's Play channel. I'm there, just having fun, being super cash enjoying some fun games. Right now, we have Pokemon Legends Arceus, possibly the only good Pokemon game on Switch. Okay, well, the only good Pokemon game next to Pokemon and Snap. We are also enjoying The Outer Worlds, the Switch port. It's a very fun Fallout clone, if a, uh, you know, in fact, if you're looking for a game that's exactly like Fallout, but maybe just a little bit more well thought out, um, I'd go for this game, and it's on Switch. And of course, we are keeping things bumping and funky with Bomb Rush Cyberfunk. This homage to Jet Set Radio made by Team Reptile. It is super fun, super bouncy, and probably has the best soundtrack of 2000 and... Yeah, 23. 2023. That's how you say that. You can also catch us live on Twitch. Z-E-K-E, -E, Cosmic Rejects. Zeke Cosmic Rejects. All one word on Twitch. Right now, we are enjoying the FPS classic, Quake 2, taking it to the Strog and taking it to them good. And if you're looking for new, um, we are doing the third in the Famicom Detective Club series, Emio the Smiling Man. It is a point and click murder mystery visual novel created by Nintendo, first party title. Um, it is also M-rated, and it is full of murder and gore, so... Yeah. Of all the things you expected from Nintendo, I bet you didn't expect that. If you like what you see here, uh, please check out this channel and give it a shot. 